everybody. It, I was going to oh, say God. good morning, but it's not morning. No, it's, in the afternoon. it's afternoon. It's Sunday afternoon. It's just after one o'clock. And let's go. We've spent the morning doing chores and stuff around the house, getting ready um, for tomorrow's photo shoot. I am not, neither one of us obviously is going to be home. So I've got stuff I would normally leave until tomorrow, but we're getting it done today. So anyway. We're going to go get that done and we'll be back. So I'm here cutting up some strawberries that our gardeners get, uh, brought us yesterday uh, that are re-landscaping the backyard. And this is pretty big, right? And then you have this one. But look at this one. Look how big that strawberry is. Holy cow. Anyway, it smells delicious. I wish you guys could smell it. Hi, guys. So it's Sunday night and... My husband are gonna get up to God knows what shenanigans in the kitchen. He's already had one rum and coke, he's starting his second, and he just informed me he's committed some kind of drinking sin by having his rum and coke in a JD and Coke glass. I, I don't know what that means, I don't drink. <laughs> Even when I did drink, I still wouldn't know what that means. Okay guys, it is Monday morning, the 16th of April, and we are literally leaving the driveway right now, headed to the photo shoot in San Francisco. So, yeah, I don't know. Yep. We'll see. We'll see what happens. What happens, yeah. Be back. back room of 668 Post Street in San mm -hmm. Francisco for the photo shoot and I am just standing out of the way while they rearrange out that way <laughs> That's right. because yeah I'm just in the way of what they're doing so anyway we're, we're having back. fun we're back in the back room. by the bathroom, by the bathroom. yeah <laughs> so we're having fun I will post um, what I can when I can and uh, we'll be back bye
Okay guys, so I know you saw some clips from the photo shoot that my husband shot um, and there'll be still images that I'm going to be getting from Yahoo Small Business. That's who the photo shoot was for, by the way. And um, yeah, we're all done. Uh, done an hour earlier or more than we thought we would. Um, I think mostly because I just was like, okay, what's next? What's next? You know, <laughs> let's go. <laughs> I kind of push. I was a little pushy. Anyway, no. we're all done and yeah. we're trying to find our way out of San Francisco. And uh, yeah. So turn left go. onto Eddie Street. Then turn right onto Cyril Magnan Street. Yeah, there's Jeeves trying to tell us how to go. So anyway, we'll see you when we get home. Be turn back. right. Hey guys, it is Tuesday morning, April 17th. Um, I am still recovering from yesterday's photo shoot with Yahoo Small Business Web Hosting and um, it was a lot of fun. And if you need a new place to host your website and really great online editing tools, go visit them. And no, I'm not just saying that, I actually use them. My website's been hosted with Yahoo literally for years and I wouldn't recommend them if they weren't great. Anyway, that being said, I'm still recovering. I've had three cups of coffee. I probably should stop now. <laughs> I got everything put away last night except my palette, which I realized just now was out here in the garage in the sink. So I need to wash that out because I want to finish working on the unfinished canvas that we um, brought to the photo shoot yesterday um, so I can get that finished and maybe list it up in Etsy for sale. And I've got a couple other things to do too. Now that dog's barking. Sounds like the gardeners are out there. He hates gardeners. Anyway, all right, that's it for the moment. I'll be Hey back. guys, how are you? All right, so obviously I'm in the car now. It's still Tuesday. Um, I finished the painting, um, the large face. They're both a large and small um, are titled similarly, or I should say the same. The title is Stepping Into the Light. Um, the little one is number one, because it was painted at first, and the large one is number two. One or both will be for sale in my Etsy shops shortly. The large one is two feet by three feet, so it's a pretty big painting. Um, at this moment, I don't know exactly what I'm gonna charge for it, so if you're interested, email me. My email address should be in the description of the video. Anyway. That being said, I am out obviously going to run some errands because we're in the car. I need to pick up some more um, arthritis medicine for the dog, Mr. Bandit. And I need to pick up something at Lowe's and of course get the mail and all of that jazz. So I am going to go get that done and then get home so I can have some lunch and all of that stuff. And wash some laundry because now there's... You know, I've said this before, for two people, we have a lot of dirty laundry. What the heck is with that? I don't understand how two people can be so dirty. Ugh. Anyway, all right, that's it for the moment. I am going Hey guys, it's Wednesday, April 18th, my mom's birthday. Happy birthday, mom. Everybody tell mom happy birthday. <laughs> um, I am, it's just before lunch. I've spent the morning catching up on my daily writing. I got the website updated. I got the newsletter sent out. Um, I am editing video. I got a couple of videos, quick videos filmed, and then I'm editing a bunch of other video, including those. Um, there's a lot of stuff going on right now. If the video tutorial quality is not what y'all expect um, at the moment, that's just because I'm trying to keep content coming. Um, as, and as interesting of content as I can make for you, because I'm not gonna just put content out there that's crap. Um, but if it's not what some of you expect, I'm sorry, I apologize for that. 
Um, but sometimes, depending on what's going on in my life and um, how busy I am, I just do quick tutorials. Sometimes I do nothing but long tutorials. It just depends on what I'm in the mood for and what else is going on in my life. And right now things are really, really hectic. So you'll see the occasional long, long tutorial and some short ones. And we just seem to have some people that, I don't know, there's one or two people out there that are thumbs downing everything. I don't, I don't know. Um, and YouTube analytics and view time and subscribers is weird. Like one day it'll be up like 10 and the next hour it'll be down by 20. It's very strange. So anyway, um, I am done with all of my chores. The laundry is working. The garbage is out at the, out in the can. Um, I have to do the dishes, but I need to go to the laundry and the PO box. So I'm going to go do that first. Plus I don't really like doing the dishes. <laughs> There's that. Um, and I'd rather just wait until after I have lunch and then do them all. The gardener should be here today to put grass in the backyard because right now it's a giant dirt patch. Hang on, I'll That's show you. That's my backyard right, <coughs> excuse me, right at the moment. It's a giant dirt patch. So sod should be going in today. They're not here yet, but they should be here sometime this afternoon to put it in. Anyway, I'm going to go run my errands and I'll be back. everybody it is Thursday morning April 19th I only know that because I've tried to do this three times this morning this is number three hopefully third time's a charm anyway uh, we're headed out this morning it's pretty early it's just before 8 30 I have a doctor's appointment on the other side of town and it's gonna take me a while to get there so I need to be I need to leave early um, while we're there I might run a few errands on the way home my parents are coming into town today, so we'll see them later, um, and their dogs, all three of them, which we now have to keep all the dogs off the grass. I'll insert a picture here somewhere. We had um, new sod installed in the backyard, and we had the sprinkler system repaired yesterday, so anyway, nobody on the grass. No poop, no pee on the grass. <laughs> so anyway... Um, that's it for this morning, I think. There, I don't think there's a whole lot going on today. Um, mostly just my doctor's appointment and then, um, you know, non-exciting stuff like getting the mail and laundry and, you know, normal stuff. I may go to the art supply store and if I do, I'll take you guys with me. All right, I'll be back. Okay, that's not something you see in the city parking lot often. A big giant goose just sitting there. Makes me wonder if he's hurt or something. I don't know, it's interesting. So my checkup with my doctor went well and all's good. Keep doing what I'm doing. I love those words. Uh, the goose in the parking lot, I found out from the nurses, um, is one of a mated pair that have a nest up on the roof. And occasionally one or both of them are seen wandering the parking lot, probably looking for food. So anyway, pretty cool. I'm on my way to the quilting shop now and maybe the art supply store. So I'll bring you with me in oh, yeah. Golden State Quilting in San Jose. And I love this little shop. They have all these cute fabrics. Look at this. Patterns, bags, tutorials, people that can answer your questions. They have a classroom space in the back. If you're in the area, you have a chance, you need some fabric, stop by and visit. I'll put their address in the description below. Pretty cool. You ever film a whole segment and realize the camera's not on? Hello. So I think we're not going to go to the art supply store because I really don't need anything. I think I'm going to wait until I'm actually out of something. But I wanted to share really quick the cute fabrics I found at Golden State Quilting. And, um, these are all quilting cottons, um, mostly fat quarters. I did get bigger pieces of a couple designs that I really was in love with. But I found these cute birds. They had some Day of the Dead fabric, which I love. Um, this one. I don't know why I like that one, but I really like that one. They have this one with like spider webs and um, butterflies and leaves on it. A couple of batik prints. This one. 
Another plant fabric. I'm really into the plant fabrics right now, but I found it. Isn't that cute? I might make another accordion bag out of this one because that's super cute. I found this one that's kind of, um, you know, abstracted, impressionistic, kind of like, um, what do you call it? It's a fruit with the seeds. Holy cow. I can't think of it right now. Pomegranate. There you go. <laughs> Holy cow. Um, and I got these two. And this one. Super nice ladies, super cool store. They have over 2,000 bolts of fabric. And they gave me a list of other quilting shops in the greater uh, Bay Area, uh, as far away as like Santa Cruz, Gilroy, not super close. We just don't have a lot of the close ones in San Jose anymore. Um, San Juan Batista, Sunnyvale, my old stomping ground, San Mateo, Pacific Grove, Fremont. So I have this nice reference list now. She added a couple of other ones uh, that are in Santa Cruz. Um, there's a Beverly's Fabrics in Santa Cruz. It's one of the only ones that's going to stay open. And there's also another fabric store called Hearts Fabrics, which is the one she said you really need to go there. So you need quilting fabrics. You're in the San Jose area, Golden State Quilting. I'll put their website in the description below. Check them out. Super cool, very nice ladies that work there. All right, that's it for the moment. I'm going to go home. I'm starving. It's almost lunchtime, which might be why. I'll be back. Thank you.